Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure. Seven days to die. So what's going to happen today? Well, today, today is day 16, so which means that I think we need to go on an exploration run. So, what that means is I think I'm going to run down to this road here and then run along this road up this way. Then maybe kind of cut across this way and then run along that way. Or we might just run along that way anyways and explore this another time. So I think that's what we'll do is we'll run towards the north here. I'm just going to kind of see where this leads. Hopefully nowhere exciting. Hopefully no hub city yet. <laughs> we could always go this way, but I think we're going to go north and that's what's going to happen. As well, I'm going to make the blunderbuss and go from there. So, blunderbuss, how do we make you? Can we make you? So we need four forged iron Okay, I got that stuff. So let's do it right now. Let's do forged iron. We need four of these bad boys. One, two, three, four. Okay, can I make a wrench at all? Uh, not sure if I have those schematics. I'm getting confused. I can't. So let's get four more forged iron. Do we have... No, we have a good wrench right here, so that's fine. Let's throw this in here. And that's still running because I think I threw a log in there. Like so, with log spike. <laughs> okay, so let's actually... Oh yeah, see I have a bunch of stuff in here because... Yeah, because I was going to do some inventory management here. Okay, let's grab that. Okay, let's, let's do this. So we need two... We need a couple of these things. Oh, we have two springs, just enough. So we're going, to, we're going to need to take apart cars. Let's take a look at this blunderbuss. Let's make it. Okay, perfect. We're going to make a blunderbuss. Awesome. So now blunderbuss ammo. We need paper, gunpowder, and small stones, I think, would be the best for the ammo. Okay, so that's not a big deal. So let's throw our glass jars in here. Let's actually do this so I can shift click them into here. Okay, and let's drink the water. I'm not sure if we need to. Yeah, we're at 100%. That's what I figured. Okay, see, we can shift click the stuff into there, which is awesome. I don't need that. Uh, iron, we can keep together. We don't need that anymore. Uh, Gunpowder, we can keep. I don't see any paper in there. There'll be more gunpowder in here. We can even make some gunpowder. Actually, we don't need to make gunpowder because we only have 171 papers. And we have 168 gunpowder. So then, blunderbuss ammo. I'm going to make 100 of this stuff. Because that's how I do it. I make 100 at a time and then I use it up. And then I, yeah, that's just how I do it. So let's throw, oh, actually, that's not too bad, 239 for the blunderbuss, that's pretty good, I feel. Let's just throw all our kind of materials in here, cobblestone rocks, don't need our spikes. We still need that, we don't need that anymore. Forge steels for repairing our tools. Well, I guess I don't need to throw spikes in here. Maybe not the wood, but the other materials, maybe that's, ah. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so let's see here. We got this. Let's throw this away. Throw the lead trophy in there. Actually, no, the trophies we should be able to put into here. Yeah, there's one more to melt down. Ah, so cool. So, yeah, so there you go, folks. So, I will be back as soon as it's daytime here. Okay, I'm back a little bit earlier here, but I just want to kind of explore the the pistol making stuff so my understanding is to take ammo out you can hit assemble and that will take the ammo out of the gun so if i do it with this as well it will do the same things so now we have more ammo i think i have pistol skill now so what i was doing is i was looking on each of these to see which one's better is better we're going to scrap this gun because it's obviously no good but this one we're going to actually take apart and replace some parts with so we go assemble and I think we just click and drag like so and we have a pistol barrel perfect so and then we'll use the repair kit to repair this so if I go close 
See, now we have a little bit better pistol. Okay, and I think this this we can just melt down, I believe. A repair kits. So what do we need to make, uh, make those repair kits? This is where the oil is going to come in handy. So we need forged iron and duct tape. Okay, how much oil do we have? We have 46. Let's make 10 forged iron. Ah, forged iron. <laughs> 9, 10. Uh, and then I don't have any burnables on me now because I threw them in here. We'll, we'll throw, I'll throw another log spike into that because it's, it seems to burn a long time. So that might be the best one to use potentially. It's 10 wood, I think, to make these. Okay, so 10 of these. So this is why we need the clay, and this is why we need steel in here. Because it's all part of it, all part of it. Let's throw that in there. And yeah, so yeah, so that's cool. So we have a working pistol now. I actually want to throw this stuff into here instead of scrapping it. We can probably just throw this into there. I'm not sure if it rounds up or down. It'd be nice to see if there was decimal places. But yeah. Okay, so we got the forged, the ten forged iron there. So now we need ten duct tape, ten oil. We got the duct tape. We need the oil. And what else do we need? We need cloth fragments. Look at that, you need a lot of those you know, basic components that you you find. And then we can create 10 of these. And there you go, that will increase our gunsmithing as well. Let's throw this stuff back in here. Okay, let's actually... I don't know if I want to carry the gun with me today. I might want to use the gun. Let's smelt down the pistol. Perfect, okay, so this is working out quite nicely. So. So I think we're going to, let's see, can we repair this pistol? Let's go repair. Oh, it's going to sit in the queue now, I think. But that's okay, because we're only making 10 of these repair kits. So that is fine and dandy. I'm going to throw these bullets back in here. Let's actually throw all this iron. Oh, shoot, we have a lot of iron right here. Yeah, let's throw that in here. We do need to collect some clay. We do need to do some, some harvesting. In that response, or in that response, in that respect. <laughs> oh man. So yeah, so I'll be back when it's morning. Okay, so it's of course morning. I was hoping that the timers on this would have been a little bit faster, but that's okay. So we're gonna throw this this stuff into here. We have our blunderbuss. Is it reloaded? Let's reload it. Bang. Perfect. Now this will continue doing its thing for as long as it is. So let's r r run outside and yeah. Okay. Okay. So where are we gonna go? We're gonna go north, I think. We're gonna follow the road and go north. Maybe dismantle some cars. Kind of maybe do that for a minimum. We do have lots of space, or relatively good space. Ah, oh, this feels good. This feels good to get out. Okay, so I'm going to probably just continuously shoot this and we'll see how long it takes us to go. I might, st ooh, hello bear, that's a good way to not start the day, <laughs> let's just kind of go around the bear, where are you, there, where are you? Should be able to go this way, should be okay. Does that mean I've been here before? I want to get that white car, but... I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Let's run down here. Okay, where is it? Where is the bear? See, they move quickly. Ah, anyways. There's a car coming up here. Zombie there. Oh, look, there's food there. Hello, zombie. So we still need to use up these arrows. So we got the stone arrows. And then we'll, of course, do our strategy of r running up to them and beating them up. Oh, what's going on here? Okay, there's a little bit laggy there for a moment. It was really weird. Hit the escape key. 
And let's dismantle this car. Okay, so I stopped dismantling that because I don't want to do that right now. So we're just going to carry on. And we're going to not even loot. I'm just going to kind of run along this way. Okay, so that's the, the road to that point of interest. Hello, hello, zombie. Yeah, we're going to ignore you. And I'm just going to run along this road here. What's that? Is that a dog? That's a dog. Why is there a dog there? Come on. Did I hit it? Aw, oh, man. Why is the AI so stupid? Oh, come on. There we go. That was worth it. We've got a couple zombies coming up here on us. Let's take care of that. The usuals here. Come on. Yeah. Bang. Perfect. Woo. Come on. There we go. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Some materials here. More materials here. Look at this. Just smorgasbord. Smorgasbord of stuff. The doggy. Um, nah. I'm not gonna, well, well, whatever. I think we still get a hide from them, but that's usually not very good. Let's see here. Yeah, so you still get some hides. That's not too shabby there. Come on. Okay. I think there's a bone. Okay, so let's throw out the rotting flesh. We'll try and keep the large bones because I think that's used for glue. And let's carry on, carry on, carry on. Let's try out the blunderbuss. Should have used it on that dog, but. That's okay. Instead, we clubbed it. And the road just... Ooh, okay. See, this is... This makes me wonder if there was, like, a map change. Oh, there's an airdrop? Okay, we're actually going to go towards that airdrop. I don't remember there being an airdrop out here, but... I'm not going to say no to an airdrop. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's, let's follow the road. It goes straight to the airdrop anyways. Huh. There's some cars to explore. Search. Where is this? There's a lot of zombies, actually. But that's okay. Where is it? Ah, here it is. Here it is. Ooh, yeah. Okay, I think we picked up everything. Man, that was awesome. Who would have thought that we would have found a supply crate out here? Huh. Let's run back to the road. It's kind of where I want to. There's a point of interest road off this side here. Let's actually follow that. The cars will kind of leave because I do want to dismantle these, but at least we know now there's a bunch of cars. Maybe we can explore the cars here. Some duct tape is good. Let's see here. Oh, yes. AK 47 receiver. A rocket launcher schematic, we already know that, so we're just going to scrap this one. Alright. Uh, because we're naturally increasing your gunsmithing, I don't want to augment it. Oh, that's so cool. So that's a useful piece. So, it looks like we'll get the AK-47, but it's going to take a while. I hope we get it eventually, because I do want to you know, use it. Look at that, we're already full here. Dang it. Okay, I guess I can always throw away those corn seeds. We don't need those. I hate throwing away stuff. This looks like this is a camp. Hello, hello. Hello, can we try this out? Woo! Yeah, okay, this is going to be interesting. Let's try this out again. Bang. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, hey, bugger. Okay. No, now you're going to get one in the face. Hello. 
There's all kinds of zombies everywhere. Oh, come on. <laughs> hello, hello. Now, does it hit more than one? There's a car here. What are you doing? Bang. Okay. This blunderbuss is not very good, is it? Whoa. Oh, come on. Oh, well, at least my shotgun skill will increase. Oh, there we go. I think that's one. Woo. It's kind of neat how when you miss, it does the dirt. Woo. Come on. Oh, I hit that guy. <laughs> What's that? That's a pig? Oh. Okay, come on. There's a lot of a lot of zombies. Bang. Okay. Woo! This is fun! This is fun, I have to tell ya. Come on. I'm gonna have to probably cut it here soon because well, you can watch me doing this for a long time. Well, maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. I'm a bad aim on this guy. Come on. Committed to the reload animation. Okay, let's beat these guys up. Come on. <laughs> there we go. All taken care of. Let's kind of do some looting here. Uh, nothing. Nothing. How about this one? Um, yeah, we definitely need that stuff. Cool. Any zombies left over here. Yeah, we got a couple here. I love how the zombies stick around longer now. Because now we can definitely... Ooh, hello. Hello. Is this a horde or is this... The same stuff. Uh, I'm hitting you in the hand. There we go. Nah, nah, it's probably just... Finishing, finishing of the spawn. Oh, no, that is a horde. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. Let's back off here a bit. We don't want to take on a whole horde, do we? Huh. I just came around the corner. Good thing we we kind of There we go. Good thing we retreated out of that. Okay, so that was the camp, so let's let's carry on here. I'm gonna continue on this way when I come across something interesting. I'll be right back. Okay, so here we are. So basically I continued along the road. We found this road so I ran up it and it forks off and we got what looks like a church over here church slash cemetery kind of thing that is really cool not sure how well this would hold up you could build probably spikes around it the iron bars might be whoa oh iron bars might be okay whoa where are you ah, come on Oh shit. Yeah, I'm just gonna bash this bastard. Okay, there we go. Okay, and pop some pills here. Okay, perfect. Fido. <laughs> I don't want this guy. I do want the hides. We'll let them kind of bash their way out. We're probably just gonna run away from this. Consumed enough food to slowly heal, yeah, that should still be, yeah, we're just gonna run away from this situation, so that's cool, hey, I don't know if the point of interest road goes f further, but uh, we're gonna have to definitely investigate that, definitely investigate that, but the point today is just to explore, so we'll head back to the road here, and I will carry on. 
Okay, so here we are. We're coming upon. So looks like it's a cross. It's a cross. Yeah. Okay. So which way do we go? Do we head more north? Or do we head to the south? We got some incoming zombies here that are gonna pose a problem. Let's try to use our bow this time. There we go. Go after that guy. We'll wait for that guy to get up. Okay, and uh, how about this guy? Missed. Perfect. Okay, uh, let's see here. What do we have on here? Let's see here. There we go. One more bash. There we go. Perfect. Anything interesting? Oh, look at that. <laughs> Another mining helmet. We'll just scrap that one. Okay, so I'm going to go actually to the south here. And you know what? I tell you what. I think it's going to be about time to log off here. So thank you everybody for watching. Hope you've enjoyed you know, this episode. This episode was a little bit different. It, uh, it is me out exploring. Oh, snap. Okay, we definitely want those. So I think we can make some duct tape out of the glue. Alright, and let's actually scrap this into so it combines into one stack. And then we can pick those up because we do need those. <laughs> Excellent. And so yeah, so thank you everybody for watching and I look forward to seeing you all in the next episode. Bye bye. Right, even though your wrench is broken, you can still use it to upgrade. Really? I didn't know yeah. that. Cool. Yeah. So I'll grab my wrench that's in the box then, and I'll do that for my single player. Cool. Yep. Yeah. That's Thank why you. I was kind of curious why you weren't doing it. I Wait, didn't realize did it would stop. Like, I thought it would just stop working. I never... Yeah, that's oh, why. fixing it? Upgrading? I got a broken one myself in a box. Okay, I guess we want Screamer Girls to come now. I don't. That's so much... Crap, I'm not cooking now. anything. <laughs> Somebody's cooking lots. Somebody was making water and I added something to that, but then I was yeah. like, oh, I need something, so I added something to another fire. Well, the spikes will take care of it. I repaired the spikes that were you damaged outside, so most of them are fixed up and everything. Okay, cool. Okay, so I've got your your iron armor in the drop-off box up top here. The evil giraffe -y. Cool. Thanks. You're welcome. Is this the one you were talking about, Jace? The sawed off shotgun. <laughs> yeah, that awful one. <laughs> yeah, good thing you didn't. Good thing no, you didn't I, use that I, against I, the bear. No, I have. Uh, <laughs> I have other parts, uh, like the other stuff that I threw up there. All the yeah. uh, the shotgun parts. They're they're still not that great, but they're better than just the well, that regular shotgun. See, oh, there you go. Oh my God, that receiver sucks. <laughs> yeah. Hey, man, it's all I found. Yeah. What it is. Quality Joe, man. Quality Joe. Oh yeah, good. I should look at my skills. I got 11 points. Woohoo! I got five. So what do I purchase? Later. Oh yeah. So yeah, I'm not sure. How much have you played of Alpha 14? Are you evil Draffy? I don't think I've played any. So if you look under your your like the usual spot where you look under like your character, there'll be like a skills. One that you can click on, and when you look in there, you'll see that there's like skills now for a lot of stuff. Okay, then I have played it since they've added that, but it does look updated since the yeah. last time I played. Mm -hmm. But I don't know what I should be using my points on. Well, like for example, probably the things that reduce how much you eat and drink or how much stamina you use. Probably good ones. Right, like the survivor or the rem forest run, right off the bat, at least. Camel, um, if, if sexual tyrannosaurus. Yeah, quality Joe is a good one to. Don't worry about uh, a workbench, cement mixer, all that stuff. Because or I steel. Already. Yeah, any more scavenging to get the next level of quality Joe? So I should actually probably just get. Oh, cool! There's something called pummel peat. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's cool. I wonder if I should pick that because I like to pummel people with blunt. Yeah, I if, you, if you do a lot of blunt, hmm. I, do. I sure do like beat people's heads in. Yet. I'm gonna pick the survivor, I 
think. Or run forest, run, I don't know. Decisions, decisions. Find iron yet? Oh, he's, okay, he's going, uh, the... If you keep going, you're gonna end up coming out the... I'm going straight hill, down. I think. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm going, going straight down, down at this point. I was, and, down, and then I, I realized the exact same thing. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't get very far a before I realized. A little secret entrance it, into the thing. We get all these zombies show up. What? Where did you guys come from? I get Very more good, here. more good like, footage. I heard you had an open house. Day eleven. Wow. So that means yep. day twelve will have the dog horde and. Dog yep. Hordes. So yeah, the just next. Into the middle of the pond and and filled uh -oh. it up in the center. Okay, What's now, happening? What? What? She stepped on the fire. I don't understand why. <laughs> I always accidentally do Does that. Does that actually? That's her thing. I, I didn't mean to. <laughs> <laughs> you know you want to stand too close because of the stupid heat thing. Yeah, and yeah. She walked yeah. right on top of it. Like. <laughs> Not a care in the world. Oh, do, do, Not do, a do. care in the world. But do yeah. some fire walking. <laughs> yeah. You know how those coal walkers or whatever you walk on the coals. Good times. Yeah, good good times. team building exercises. <laughs> mm -hmm. You when it hits daytime, you want me to get a bunch of iron, right? Yep. Yeah. Sure. Because okay. I want to get these walls to iron. Okay. Found some iron myself. Are all the spikes <laughs> now upgraded to, like, all fixed up from our last? Uh, except for the ones that ran into them here in the middle of the night. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> but most of them, if not all of them, should be, yeah. Okay. Cool. I had to replace a bunch of them as well. There's some missing, so, of the, the yeah, crappier ones, right? But that's cool. Yeah. I didn't want to pick for, run forest run because we do a lot of running, and yeah, the stamina do. degradation would be, you know, like be better, right? So minus twenty percent less stamina drops down while you're running, so that would be effective for combat, effective for everything, really. So that's what I bought. <laughs> that was the one I was thinking to save for. Well spent. Yeah, well, you do have to earn up the skills. Like if you notice on some of them. Um, let's see here, if I go into the skills, you'll see, so for example, for me, my run force run is 2 out of 5, but if I want to get the 3, I need to make sure I'm level 20 for yeah. level 3. Right? Some of them have level requirements, other ones have, there's like a skill well, requirement. That, is that all just scavenging for Quality Joe? Quality Joe, or yeah. Actually, uh, Quality Joe scavenging is scavenging. Levels. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, scavenging level 30 for the new level 2 yeah. a quality Joe, exactly. But for like sexual Tyrannosaurus, you need athletics up. Um, yeah. yeah. So I need to get 40 athletics for the next level to be able to purchase. Yeah. And that's stamina like, gain. Yeah, like I, I put into stamina some points, and like now when I harvest stuff and that, whatever, like I don't need to worry about my stamina going down. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really nice. So it just depends how you want to develop your character, right? And yeah. I kind of like these like, skills. This is why I like multiplayer too, because uh, I don't know for some reason I always, bases. End, I always end up like building bases. I don't like the looting part as much. So mm. really, if someone else can do that, that's great. Mm. That's cool. Literally covering different bases in that case. Yeah. yeah I always like building like a role playing game team. Yeah. yeah. To me, to me, just the same old. It's boring. So. <laughs> I like a I little like, bit of everything. I like the oh, creativity yeah. of the base building. I like the looting because you get better and better stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, as you loot, eventually, okay, you know, where's all this I'll, better and better I'll, stuff? I like the survival <laughs> elements. <laughs> you have to loot a lot. Like, a lot. <laughs> Looting's fun. Looting's a good time. I say. Once you got more of the map kind of explored, which is kind of cool. Yeah. So there's like a road yeah, kind of cool. up where, uh, Evil Giraffe started, so it's kind of it'd be kind of neat to explore that area up there, northeast mm. of the the hub city, basically. There's also a road like direct uh, east of us, not that mm -hmm. far. Yeah, exactly. And that one going south, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Wonder where that goes. You need or, to find like a, a little a little town, right? Or the one going west. Mm -hmm. I kind of want to go that to direction. Find. That's where you get your better loot. Yeah. We need to find like the working stiff or. Whatever, any of those kind of places. Yeah. They changed Did the barns. Did you guys know that they changed the uh, the Barnes and Noble name? <laughs> no yep. longer yeah. Born and Noble. Aww. Yeah. 
Because well, I think the Telltale legal department told them maybe to change it to something different. But they kept the MacDiver book, and you think they would have changed that? I know. MacDiver? Yeah, yeah MacDiver, yeah. But it's yeah. MacDiver. It's yeah. one letter different. Change, mm -hmm. right? That's close enough. With Born and Noble, it sounds yeah. really close to the real, like, Noble. Yeah. I can see. They just don't want to take chances, and I don't blame them. Well, that's what happens when a big company takes over. The, all the kind of the soul gets sucked out of the game. Or what yeah. you do is you get funding from Walmart, and you, you get funding from Barnes and Noble, and all these people that want to put their store into a post-apocalyptic setting, so that way you can come across these buildings that are decrepit and filled with zombies. <laughs> I guess they wouldn't like that to see that, right? No. I guess. There's a reason why a lot of racing games that have licensed cars don't let you actually crash the cars or wreck the cars. Because mm -hmm. they don't want uh, people to wreck to their cars. To wreck the brand, right? <laughs> yeah. Find any iron yet? I found a little bit. I'm not hitting any real huge veins yet, but we're okay. still digging. So we are uh, so actually hitting some. That's pretty cool. That See, they, that we have. I, actually, I got, I got, well, I got 58 iron on mm -hmm. me at the moment. Oh, wow. So that's actually. Uh, Cooking up red tea. I'm impressed. That would be me. And golden rod. Wow. <laughs> yep. I didn't have that one's red. useful. That person can stay. Do we turn <laughs> some of that into seeds? I have. I didn't have any more of the. Well, I already have the golden rod seeds. So that okay. Cool. Yeah, I don't think and chrysanthemums. I, I don't think you can turn to seeds. So at least I haven't no, tried. Yeah. I don't think It'd you be can. Nice if you could. Because that's that's superior to the golden rod, anyways. Golden rod's kind of it's like a zombie say stuck. That's if you get the the squirt. Yeah, it's only good for exactly. that. Exactly. Did you see that zombie there running along along the wall, or is that just a glitch for me? Just a glitch. Because there's someone else up here, isn't there, on the deck or no? Or am I the only one? Anyways, it's four o'clock. So we need a cooking grill if you guys ever find one for the last fire. Place. Yeah, no, it's a it's a legitimate zombie. Not that it really it's just matters stuck. because the only thing you make with it is baked potato now. So. <sighs> really? Oh, man. Cooking grill? Yeah, yeah. Cooking grill is only for baked potato now because they change the bacon uh, eggs to use the pot. So, the grill is almost pointless now. Yeah. Bang. Woohoo! Level up. Virgin like a bunny rabbit from a gopher hole. Or a okay. gopher from a bunny no, rabbit. No, it was hole. a legitimate uh, zombie that was stuck. It was pretty funny. Oh, Adorable. I ended his misery, Hello. so it's okay. Okay, here's our wonderful... You really, you really like that fire, don't you, Evil Jeffy? Loves fire. It's mesmerizing. She's, sitting there, she's like uh, <laughs> crouched, staring right into the flames. You know, like... Pretty. Well, I was debating on turning it off or letting it continue. So how do you? Well, if it's oh. if it's still cooking, let it go. That's why you just put in uh, just what you need to cook what you got, and then you don't have to worry about it so much. Well, I was not the one who put all that wood in there. Oh, okay. So but how do you oh, you mine this? Actually, it's, it's actually. Oh, let's see. Has this changed? It seems quite dangerous here. No, it hasn't. Well, it removes dysentery one, implying there's more levels of dysentery. Yay! Probably, yeah. Oh my God, no. Uh oh, zombies are coming. What do you mean zombies are coming? I hear it. No, I'm I'm like at the mine. Okay. Watch out then. Great. Fall in. There was a. Which way are they coming from? Outside. Oh, I, I just heard some zombie noises. <laughs> Great. Oh well, at least it'd be good footage. Yep. <laughs> um, okay, so there's just enough wood to cook the golden rod tea that's in there, so now we don't have to worry about micromanaging it. So where is this is iron? Is it, is it like in he like in these little like grooves yeah. that you formed? Yeah, that, that, that I formed. Yeah, Holy exactly. crap! How the hell do you <laughs> access these grooves? Yeah, yeah, very carefully. There must be a place to kind of crawl in, right? Oh, here we go. Wow. I'll take, take those with me. I found, I found access. Here we go. I found something down here. Maybe hopefully. At some point, is... I'm going to have to put down some uh, cobblestone frames because really the way to get out is kind of sketchy now. But... Not cobblestone frames, wood frames. It's a little bit mix of everything that you get now. Yeah, it is. It's not it like. Is. Uh... But there is actually a lot of iron now. Iron, lead. 
Oh, there we go, there's iron. Oh, it's amazing with the the steel. Yeah, it is. It's like it, it's like butter. We really need to build a wall around this place, and well, I guess it depends how yep. much materials here. But how do I go down in here? Can I actually just drop down in here? And... Like it's safe in here because you've gotten out, Damn it. right? Well, it depends where you're talking about. Um, like, are you talking about that cave? It, yeah, the cave looks like it's un. Um, untouched in there. We're yeah, gonna have mine company, there guys. I don't know if you can get out once you drop in. I don't know how big that drop is. So. Make sure you have some frames with you. Yeah, I got wood and I got some frames. Maybe I should drop in and see what happens. Yeah. What's the worst that could happen? Death. And then good luck with corpse retrieval. It looks like there's huh. a big pit down, like a cave going yeah, no, down as well, so you have to I be mean, careful. Yeah. So you have yeah, to kind of exactly. go to the left. Right, the only problem is I don't see any materials. Um, okay, I see. It's like a mine. It's like a interesting. You need a lot we're of frames. We're getting more zombies now because we're actually cooking a lot, so that's why there's more zombie mm. activity. We're attracting them. When it's just you and I, there's not that much going on. So a this thing in the wall, what is he it? Was screaming, but I don't see anything coming. Oh, no, because he died. The spider zombies don't call it hordes, it's only girls. Yeah. Like ring girls. Oh, really? That, I didn't realize that that had changed. I thought they were also yeah, they screamers. Changed. No, no, they no. When, no. When they added the ring girl, Good. they stopped the... <laughs> the ring <Spire>. girl? <laughs> That's what she zombies. is, man. She's the ring girl. So creepy. The other girl, like the, uh, I don't know, the one I, I tend to call Emily for whatever reason, reminds me of the, uh, the girl from Night of Living Dead. The one who, uh, if you've ever seen the original, it's the, the chick, like the daughter, who's uh, sick in the basement. Mm-hmm. Reminds think so. me of her from the uh, the I remake, so. the 1991 remake. Like, not, okay. Oh, yeah, the yeah. colored one, basically, right? Where... Yeah, the one with, that had the uh, the red-headed girl as the main character. Instead of yeah. being a weak female character mm -hmm. who was just shell-shocked the whole time, she was the hero. Yeah. That hero right, now is, I think this way is a good way to get down now. Yeah, that's the way I go, yeah. Here, this rock here. Special effects artist Tom Savini actually directed that movie. Mm -hmm. The reason why yeah. they did it, uh, Romero and uh, and company did that version of the movie as a remake because they accidentally put the original out without a copyright on it. So they wanted to make a version that was very much theirs that they owned. So there. Interesting. Movie tidbits for you. Yeah, I didn't. Didn't realize yeah. you were gonna get that from a gaming channel. <laughs> I just thought that they wanted to remake the the Night of the Living Dead as a color instead of black and white. Yeah. Okay. They they, they specifically wanted to be able to own a version with a copyright. Hmm. Because they were originally gonna call it uh, what was it Night of the Flesh Eaters was the original name. Yeah, terrible. And that name was a little too scintillating for the '60s. Uh, but that wouldn't have really worked well or caught on well either. I don't think it no, called it would have. It was too schlocky. Mm -hmm. So yeah. So what are you doing exactly? So I understand I'm why you. I'm just you're... trying to. I'm just trying to clear it out so it's a little more navigated. Getting an amber. Oh, okay. Did you guys get amber alerts to your cell phones up in Canada? Nope. No. We don't care if our children go missing. We're happy. Yeah. Well, a seven-year-old is missing in a black four-door sedan. It comes We're through Canadian. the news. Our children can take care of themselves. It comes yeah. through. The, it comes through the news if there is uh, like anyone, you know, like that. It doesn't happen too often. Yeah. It's weird. We well, we also get like weather alerts too. Do you guys like storm alerts to your phones or anything like that? No, well, we don't get weather that's that severe. Yeah, we that, that we would severe. consider that that's that severe. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. We get but, flooding alerts and tornado alerts to our phones. Like here, here the worst is. Is they would shut down the highway because of like avalanche uh, or anything like that, right in the mountains? But yeah, I don't know, flooding and stuff. Not really, not too often unless it's a really crazy year. Then it's different. But I find if you're mining here and, and you mine too far, these things will kind of fall on you. That's why I'm trying to get rid of them. Ah, uh, okay. Because if you go underneath too far, they will fall. Interesting. So they're like right now they're like widow makers. So I'm trying to get rid of them. I understand. Oh, a bear! Oh, no. That's unbearable. Oh no, it hurts. 
Don't let uh -oh, it kill you. Here. Really? It murdered me. <laughs> oh no. I was like right here. in front of the base. I heard really? it. That yeah. means the bear was right out front of the spikes. Well, I was like running to the base, and then I turned around because I was like, "What is that crazy noise?" Of a yeah. bear? I see what you mean, Jace, about uh, being attacking you from twenty feet away. He actually did, you know, yeah. swipe you from quite a distance. Yeah. Yeah. In the world. Uh, that that was BS. Well, mm -hmm. you know, that's from. that's that's. It is. And that's kind of why they want to address the multiplayer stuff, right? Half of the yeah. building is now missing. Makes sense. So oh shit, I guess shit, I shit. Latency issue. <laughs> or something really bad happened. Hmm. While we were gone. You've been gone. <laughs> okay, get rid of this. Okay. Oof. I keep go. getting iron, so apparently this area that I'm digging in is just rich with beautiful, iron. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. See, so lucky Jace. I got uh, 104 so far. Oh, that's not 100 and... a lot. No, but when you're just digging straight through rock, I'm grabbing like, every in time this, I... In this pit, we've gotten like thousands of iron in this pit. Where's your pit at? I haven't been there. Where we're at right now. We're both in there, yeah. I think I marked it too. Tracking. I can't remember if I marked it or. No, I oh, yeah, the bear's it. still out there. It's a really big black pit, so. Yeah, it's. Uh, black, black, hard, my soul! Hard to okay. miss. There we go. Okay. Oh, here we go. Oh. Some more. All right. I shared it. So. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, no, no, no. no. Color just Ladders. changed here. That's not good. What's changed? Uh, just this rock here is getting... The color changed after I, I demolished something, so it's like, oh, I think it's getting unstable. <laughs> yeah. You really need to watch that. <laughs> like, I'm always looking up, going, okay, how big is this outcropping? Is it gonna fall on oh, me? Oh, man. Oh, what am I? I'm stuck here. What the hell am I stuck? There we go. Oh yeah, my stamina is like full all the time. That's cool. Yeah. Oh hey, bear! Don't bring any bears here. There's a bear in front um, of the house. Okay. Huh. The bear is okay, guarding. Okay. How come when we're here it's fine, and all of a sudden you guys show up and there's a bear in front of the house? Yeah. I don't know. What, what are you guys doing? Oh, here he comes. Seriously. That Maybe. is a zombie bear. Oh Jesus. No. You didn't tell me it was a zombie bear. There, there's no I zombie don't know. bears. It looked black to me. Well, sure there's no zombie bears? Run him into the spikes and you should be Yeah, run him in. It looks like it's covered in blood. Oh yeah, he's running around on the spikes. Man, there you go, stream. Hopefully you got a lot of viewers. <laughs> Hi pal. Come here, bear. Depends what you're trying to do. Eva, can you shoot him with anything or you don't yeah, have your stuff? Or you're arrow. just kinda attacking I mean, this yeah. stuff here. And arrows. Hmm. Here, I'll, here, I'll, I'll make him go over this way. Go over to the little there. bridge and maybe yeah. you get a good beat on him. Uh, is he dead yet? Oh, I'm gonna shoot him in the I butt. Got 500 uh, scrap iron, or sorry, scrap iron, iron, not scrap iron. I like to call it scrap iron because yeah. that's what it used to be called. That's what it used to be, yeah. Yeah, it's like the the leather. It used this to be called leather strips. Super pissed off. Oh, well, there's a backpack right here. This is that? Mine where the bear. That's where the bear was. Careful. The bear's not dead yet. Watch out, guys. Careful. Where's the bear it. exactly? On the He's spikes. Spinning. He's having fun. He's having a good old time. All right, bear. Oh, where are you? Oh, yeah, look at that. It looks bloody. Where I'm standing. Yeah! Or is it bloody because it's damaged? Or No, yeah, that is a zombie bear. I never seen I one told before. You it was a zombie bear. It has red I eyes. I haven't seen one either. I'm out of arrows, so it doesn't matter. Good thing I'm on. Uh, wow. Oh, he's mad now. Oh, look. He's he really mad. mad now. Um, let's oh. make sure. Yeah, I gotta change these lips to iron bars. He's much better. Yeah. See, now he's smart, now he's hiding. <laughs> he's still walking on the spikes though, so as long as he keeps yeah. moving. Because yeah. the more he moves, the more damage he takes. Oh, there he is. Yeah. But yeah, they've really oh, beefed their out. hit points on these things. He's dead? Nope. No, 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 no they're, they're a lot. Dead. They're a lot. Who's he following you? Probably me. Yeah, whoever. Getting him full of uh, bits of rock. He's dead. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's or very. Is, uh, uh, is he accessible? Um. Right here. Okay. I wonder what's on him. Meat. Yeah, really. Lots and really? lots of meat. But You're going bloody? after it. Yep. Sweet. Evil. Your bag is uh, over here. There's a, another oh, zombie yeah. hidden. Wow, look at all the, the damage it did. Oh, of course. He's under the spike, so I may not be able to. Oh. I hear a zombie, though. Alright. <laughs> He's dead. Crawlers. Yep. Oh, this tree's can't big. Get him. That's the problem with the spikes. If they fall underneath it, you can't, you can't get them. Yeah. Yeah, no he point in trying to. Spikes. Oh, look at it. He broke the wall. Nice. There's, um, yeah, he would. If you stand in one spot. Oh. Alright. Woo! Boom! <laughs> oh, oh my god. You guys trying to kill us? Oh, you guys are clear. Exactly, Don't worry. <laughs> hey there, zombie bear. It was close to Jace, really, but he was alright. He was. Yeah. As long fine. as he didn't move, he would have been fine. As long as I didn't jump onto the spikes voluntarily. <laughs> but with me, you never really know. You never really know for sure. Yeah, you just have to. You move near them and then you hit spikes. Like. A little breathing it, room. It's like their little magnet or something.